A Columbiana area family is asking for help to get a service dog to assist their five-year-old daughter who has nonverbal autism. Matt Stone spoke with the family who says caring for Laney requires a lot of close attention. So now what color? Always Colors. Like any five-year-old, Laney Mason likes to play and explore. Laney doesn't have any physical limitations. Um, she can climb like a monkey. Laney is a nonverbal autistic child. She's happy, active, and affectionate, but she can get frustrated when she can't express herself. And that can be dangerous. The service dog would intervene when she does get frustrated to the point where she will self-harm. Um, she will bang her head on a tile, the window, as hard as she can. The service dog would recognize that and intervene and hopefully stop that behavior. And since Lainey likes to run, her parents are worried she may get away from them. Her being nonverbal, uh, she doesn't answer when we call, so it's incredibly scary. Um, the dog will be trained to search and rescue, so God forbid that ever happens, the dog will be trained for her scent and be able to find her. A service dog would be life-changing for the family since they can't really go anywhere because she takes off. The dog is not cheap. To even get on a waiting list, they need around $23,000. Some of Kim's co-workers have helped to raise around 8000 for the family to get that dog. If you would like to contribute to Laney's service dog fund, you can find that information on our 21 News app. With more local news, I'm Matt Stone.